So, hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So, when I uh, calibrate this uh, full of the seven digital multimeters, so lead always uh, upper occurred in the display, so lead blinking and then continually beep. So, uh, there's an alarm, lead blinking alarm. So, in all calibrations, so let's fix this uh, problem. And then let's open the multimeter. So then there are three screws on uh, the middle, there is one on the bottom. There are two also for this. And then let's open. So there are two fuse inside. So fuse one and fuse two. Now let us test the fuse first. I'm using also the digital tester. So calibrate to continuity. So let us test the fuse one. So, so as you can see, fuse one is okay. There is a continuity. Then fuse two. There is no reading for fuse two. There is no continuity. So the fuse is blown. So this fuse two is closed. Fuse is blown. Defective. It's open. So we have here another fuse for replacement. Let us test if it is okay. So it's okay. There is a continuity. The same rating, 1000 volts. Now let's remove the defective views. And then replace uh, so they already depicted this fuse. And here is the replacement. Uh, let's fix it now. It's okay, fix properly, and then close properly. Closing. So check the bottom if uh, not stuck up. Side by side, the, the rubber. Now let's test. Let's test the flock at the seven. All calibrations. So in uh, voltage AC, let's test. Oh, there's no need <coughs> of blinking. So it's okay now. As you can see, then voltage DC measurement. Okay, no lead blinking. Mirror bolt, calibration. Still okay, and then resistance and capacitance continuity. It's working good. Diode and transistor test, okay. Then current measurement, the micro ampere and ampere. So, it's, it's okay. Working good. And then micro ampere, current measurement. So all, cal all cal calibrations are okay. So we repaired the problem of clock at the seven uh, lead blinking and uh, continually beep thank you guys